Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video I have my most insane Warzone game, literally my best one I've ever played. It's a solo game, I'm using the shotgun attachment on the FAMAS, it's so overpowered, it's actually insane. And I also come across aimbot hacker who beams me off a roof from miles away. So, so annoying, I thought my game was over there, but believe me, it's not. I managed to actually get my revenge on this hacker and go on to win the game, it's insane. Make sure you guys are going to watch all the video, it's at me, you can't miss, you can't even skip this video, just watch it all, honestly, it's insane, I promise you, you will not be disappointed. Make sure you're smashing that subscribe button as well, make sure you're dropping a like as well. Hope you guys enjoy the gameplay, let's run it. Okay guys, we're playing a little bit of solo uh, Warzone. Going to be landing at stadium, obviously, trying to pick up a lot of kills straight off the bat. Hopefully, I can do that. If I can try and land properly, get this supply box straight off the rip. We've got a Bruin straight off the bat as well. Super, super sick. That's where I like to start a game. Hopefully, we can find a couple of people around stadium. Two beam. I'm going to pick up the throwing knife because you never ever know. Might as well fill the slot while I can with something. I'm trying to just gauge where they could be. And this guy up close. Oh my days. Oh my. I didn't even ADS. This kid just beamed me. What? How does it kid kill me so quickly? Oh my life, he didn't even ADS either. What? But we are on buyback solos, so we do respawn straight away. We're spawning miles away from stadium. I'm debating, I'm not even gonna land there. I'm gonna try and land just outside of promenade. I've never actually landed here. I've never even landed a promenade, so hopefully we can do something over this side of the map, which we might be able to do. We're gonna land at the police station, see what we can do. I can hear someone around me. I'm going to take this flash. Oh, I don't want to move because I can hear somebody below me. I'm going to stun him. He's up the stairs, I think. Is he? I can hear him. He's stomping. He's coming up the stairs. Here he is. You're going to get flashed, my friend, and just give me the free kill there. Maybe he might have been able to take me out if he didn't have that flash. So kind of clutch because I didn't have a gun. He had an Uzi and a Bruin by the looks of things. So we will happily take that. I can try and play up. Wow, come on. So happy with that. Super happy. Let's take the Bruin. Let's try and find somebody else to beam. I've got a feeling there's going to be a couple of people around here. Hopefully we can find a few people out as I try and get up the ladder and I can't. Watch the sky. This guy's landed straight back in on me. He's weak. He's cracked. He's a nasty head glitch there. I hope there's not a gun behind there. Oh my days, there were. He managed to actually crack me. I was close to dying there. What gun did he have? An M14, I think it was. But that's a nice free little kill there. He's made the mistake of dropping straight back in on me. Maybe if he landed on the building next to me, he might have been able to take it by surprise, have a little bit of a chance, but kind of stupid, but it does give you the call out that there's an enemy above you. Is what it is. Let's try and find somebody else, though. Try and get some kills under the belt. Try and get a bit of money, try and get a loadout in, try and get this fam ass on the go, because trust me, guys, it's insane if you haven't seen it already. Still not managing to find anybody else right now. Pretty much covered this whole area. We've got another dead silence there, and I don't... I still have one, so I could do with using that up to come back for this one, but... Is what it is. I can can't I can't hear somebody around me though. I don't know where he is. I hear him slamming doors, so I'm presuming he's in this building down to my left. Well down straight in front. Whatever he may be. I don't know. I see him in the window, there he is. Noob move, my friend, there he is. Probably shouldn't have fired down my days. He knows where I am now, he knows I'm here. He knows I'm here. Where's he gonna go? I have no idea. I don't know, he could jump out the back, he could go anywhere. Just gotta wait him out here. This is the patience. The Bruin. He's gonna catch the Bruin, mate. I'm telling you. There he is. Right in the back. Should not have peaked. Should have waited it out. Absolute beams from the Bruin. It's honestly so insane. I still haven't unlocked this in multiplayer. I've unlocked a variant of it in multiplayer. I don't know how. Um, probably just bought it at some point. Uh, but you can't change any attachments on the variants now, which is so crap if you ask me. You used to be able to. We can't anymore, you actually have to have the full gun unlocked. This guy had a heartbeat sensor and all that kind of stuff and a Molotov. I think I'm going to leave the Molotov for now. I've got a trophy as well. I might keep the dead silence though with the solos, maybe. See if anyone's around me. There isn't. Pushing a little bit into Promenade. See if we can see anything. I'm getting ready for the loadout coming in in 20 seconds as well. We do have a HDR as well. There's a guy 50 meters. Oh my god, he's really close. I didn't expect him to be that close. And the Bruin. Essentially gives me a free kill, cut out in the open, caught with your trousers down mate, you are dead. Easy wins as the loadout starts coming in now. I'm going to ping, see if anyone's around, doesn't look to be in that direction. I'm going to try and look over it with my sniper for a sec, see how many there is. Oh, this guy there. I'm going to miss. There's one guy I've seen. He must have gone straight for the loadout. 
quite risky. And there's another guy, and I'm going to miss again. I'm so awful with a sniper. I feel like I could have had two kills there if I was just a little bit more snappy. Potentially. But it is what it is. I don't think these guys are going to come back and try and peek me. I'm just going to scout the area out, because obviously this area of the map, there's so many high roofs. And pushing the loadout could be dangerous, especially seeing, I've, seeing as I've seen two people there. And I don't think they know I'm here, even though Mitch did snipe at them. Maybe. I don't know. Well, they're going to know somebody's around here with the amount of loadouts that's around. So yeah, let's try and push these loadouts anyway. We're going to go the long way around and think, see what we can do. Literally been playing super passive around the loadout. I'm going to drop on it now. I don't think there's anybody around here. I've literally scouted out the whole area. We're going to take the fan last with the shotgun attachment. Trust me, hopefully we can get into a gunfight with this thing pretty soon and absolutely melt kids with it. I, I actually feel pretty confident going into a close range gunfight with this thing after seeing clips of it. I've never used it personally, this is my first time using it. But trust me, it's a it's, it's insane. It's literally a one hit kill, full armour, you know, the lot. They don't stand a chance for this thing up close and seeing as it's literally just come out today, like not come out, but people have found out about it today and it's blew up on Twitter. There might not be many people using it today, that is. Literally can't find anyone in Promenade, but I've seen someone drop a loadout straight at this Ferris wheel. You can see the purple flare smoking away. So we're going to push this kid. Hopefully we can find him out. He's going to probably have Ghost or something. And there's a guy moving across there as well. So that, there's two guys going to be around this area, more than likely. Shotgun is coming out to play. See what we can do. Here he is, this guy. Oh my days. Three shots. Wow. That kid had a growl. He was shooting me with a growl. And he gets... He's got to be so mad. He's spectating me right now, wondering what on earth just went off. What did I just kill him with? And if he doesn't know about this, he's going to see this famous shotgun attachment and be <laughs> thinking, what has just gone off? Yeah, that is Chris Gun. This attachment is absolutely crazy. He's got an armor satchel. Please, can you let me pick this up, please? It's so annoying to pick up sometimes. He had a gas mask as well and a load of other stuff. I'm going to buy a couple of UAVs as well. Try and see if we can find anybody around here. Maybe, maybe not. Everyone has ghosts on. So it's super annoying. I'm probably going to buy a munitions box as well because I don't know what the ammo is like on the shotguns detachment. I've only got four left. So definitely going to buy a munitions box in just a second. Make sure there's no one around me. Because there was another guy here. So, I mean, I have full shotgun ammo. So I don't know what, what, what ammo this thing takes. So yeah, let's just go for a munitions box we'll pop this down see if it gives us more ammo come on and apparently no it doesn't give us any more ammo that is the only downfall I've found with this thing so far oh wait no it has it has it just took a minute to update I have eight bullets in it now okay alright that's the only way I can figure out to get ammo with this thing which is gonna be a pain because you're gonna use like two to three shots probably every kill so it could be an issue with the ammo Picked up a bounty just a second ago, and he's actually super duper close. He's just on top of this uh, building, so we're gonna try and push him with this famas. He's got cold blooded on or whatever it is, ghost. Um, so we're gonna push him with the famas. I'm feeling confident that if this kid is, you know, corner camping or whatever, I will be able to spin on him with this thing, because it's honestly insane. It's, oh my god, he's moving. He just jumped off the building as I've got close. He actually has jumped off the building, hasn't he? Seeing as I've just got close. Oh, don't, oh yeah, wow, he definitely has. He's going over to the other building. But we're going to chase him. We are in pursuit. You're going to get Famas to the face. He's got to be up here somewhere. Is he going to be camping in here? No, he's just running C4 down off the roof. Give his position away. Is he going to drop down? You got the balls now? See if I can throw C4 at this kid. Yeah, he's up here. Let's throw another one. We've cracked him. Let's push him, let's push him. He's trying to fly away. Bang. Good night. See you later, my friend. Nice little easy kill there with the Famas. That thing's a beast. So he had full health, no armor, but just still insane. I thought that bird was someone dropping in then. Oh my days, I've just been beamed. Aim bot one. Bruh. Alright, so this kid just turns around randomly, does he? Oh Bruh. my days. He's literally called Aim bot one and he's killed me with an aim bot. Wow. We're respawning in anyway. That's going to be an issue. Well, why, Pete? Why, man? This guy is floating in the sky. I've never actually had a kill in the air. Let's see if we can kill this kid. Oh, oh, steady. You see me? Oh my days, you're not gonna fire back. And he's gonna get killed. Oh my days. What did he say? Mom or no? So weird. Nice little easy kill there though. Now the problem is there's only 20 people left. I have no bullets, no gun, no nothing. So we're gonna have to try and loot up quick and try and find something at least. My loadout's dropped over here. We've managed to get a P90. 
and it's on the roof of this building. I don't think there's any other way you can get up there without a helicopter. So that is actually a massive issue. I don't know what to do right now. But this is going to be a problem. A huge problem. 13 people left and I've got a P90. No extra plates, nothing. This is... This is dangerous. I need to find something that I need to figure a way to get out to this loadout drop. I literally have no idea how I'm going to get up there. At all. I don't think I'm going to be able to. I think I'm going to have to just stick it out of this P90 and try and do something at least. Try and get a kill and get some plates or hopefully they have a decent loadout. And This is not a great position to be in. I'm literally just camping this building. This kid's moving across. And wow, he was mega weak. Absolutely beamed. He's taken out of the game. I'm not even going to go for his stuff because it's going to be in the storm in a second. It's already in the storm. We had a gas mask and everything as well. That aimbot is such a bot. He's right about being a bot. An aimbot. Just a bot, man. Six people left. There's a car 98 down in this building to my right. I might have to go and take that. No chance of getting the loadout, is there? P90 in the car 98. Doesn't seem too bad to me. Definitely not. I don't think I'm going to keep the... Uh, peanut at uh, the RPG and there's a nade there but I'll keep the Molotov can sort of prevent a push of Molotov so it can come in handy literally hugging the storm right now finally managed to pick up another plate hopefully we can do something that's gonna just help us massively could do with some spares there's only four people left literally hugging the storm right now I'm gonna have to push in oh my god I'm getting beamed what the hell oh my days bang oh my days aim but a one <laughs> has just been absolutely beamed oh my god I've just killed the aimbotter who killed me he's gonna regret that massively he has just choked a massive win he managed to crack all my armor he didn't miss a shot obviously but the time to kill was not quick enough you are so crap my friend I'm gonna pick up his loot this is coming clutch he's got a gas mask he's got all the good stuff let's just play it up real quick I don't wanna get pushed whilst you know I'm down here like this in the open. I'm definitely dead if I didn't play it up. I'm trying to see if I can just scout everything out. He has a uh, some kind of streak. It's a precision airstrike. I'm going to take the PKM, I think. What's this? Yeah, it's a precision airstrike. I thought it might have been a UAV. I'm going to put that where the circle is in case somebody's in there already. I'm going to take the gas mask and I'm going to take the PKM. I'm going to keep the P90, I think. I'll take the MP7. No, I'll take the PKM. We'll roll the PKM. We'll keep the car as well. Just in case. No point in picking the arms actually. Oh my god, no way. Oh my days. Oh my god, you're gonna get killed. And he's managed to crack me. Literally in a one versus one situation. We have eight people spectating us now, so that just shows you about that kid who was aimbotting. All the people spectating him through the game. Probably think I am aimbotting now, I've killed him. I doubt it, but that just proves he was an aimbotter, obviously I've killed him and all these people spectating him have come to me. Where could this last guy be though? I'll push him around the edge. No idea where it could be. I do not see him at all. New safe zone. Where is this kid? Last chance, soldier. Kill or be killed. Literally no idea. Ten kills to our name as well. We've had a decent game. Might have the killing the aim button has just been something else for me. Literally so happy about it. And we just need to secure this win. If we choke this now, I'll be so, so gutted. There he is. Free kill. Boom. Let's go. Warzone victory. Famas is insane. We killed the aim that killed us. Couldn't stop us getting the win. Absolutely insane. My most insane game I've ever, ever played on Warzone. That was absolutely amazing. I can't believe it. Okay, guys. We're back in the lobby now. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy that. Such an insane Warzone gameplay. Can't believe I managed to get that. I did upload a clip of that uh, to Twitter earlier. Um, so, hopefully, you guys did enjoy that and uh, looked forward to this video. Sorry, it's a bit later than it, you know it should have been. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys ever so much for watching. If you guys are new around here, make sure you do smash that subscribe button. Make sure you drop a like if you did enjoy this video. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. Links for them, they're in the description below. So yeah, apart from that guys, thank you guys ever so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Peace.